Hey what's up guys my name is Rahul and today I'm here with an exciting and a very pretty basic 3D model tutorial on SketchUp that is how to create a key or model a key in SketchUp. You can use this tutorial to create a 3D key on SketchUp and you can print out it using 3d printer and you can use that as a duplicate key or you can create your own keys and locks so let's get started first you need a reference image to create a good key good looking key so go to top view then import the reference image you can find some reference image from the google images now i have this one open it then click right there click on once Assign one corner, then move, move the mouse cursor diagonally, then resize it. Then we need to outline this. So, as you can probably see right now, there is a round face. So, just create a round face using circle tool. Then use a scale tool to adjust its size and modify its shape a little bit to adjust. To fit on the outline yes this looks pretty good so now I'm going to turn on the x-ray mode to see that reference image so turn on that if you don't have this x-ray or styles toolbar you can go to view toolbars and select styles check that then close it that's all guys so now I have enabled the X-ray mode. Now again do the outline. Using you can use the line tool and the arc tool to create do the perfect outline. So next we need to outline this thing. So just outline that also okay that looks good and then off the extra mode and we need to delete these lines so you can use the erase tool or you can select that and hit delete key on your keyboard and done now we need to pull up this face before that i forgot to create one thing this round so create that round press scale tool to scale this phase then we can extrude 10 of the extreme mode then extrude this phase up a little bit not too big not you can actually do very small because it is super slim a key so this is much small I think nope a little bit up yep then extrude this face a little bit up not front face a little bit okay that looks good then zoom out and ready the key modeling has finished now we need to do some other stuffs like that deleting that phase and so now the modeling complete now we need to render it you can use any plugins or rendering software in my case I use Krakotia because it is free and it is a lot more easier and it is powerful so let's render it before that I need to color it with some sort of colors Okay, color it fully with it, then this looks pretty cool. This camera view, then export to Kikotia, save it as yes. And now our model is in Kikotia. So I'm going to turn on the solid rendering. I'm going to select this phase, the whole phase, then going to ok 
give a material give a metal material so brass looks fine I guess then render so the rendering completed then we can check the final image it looks pretty nice but we need to add some more lighting so let's do that so again go to SketchUp so let's add some lights from over here to over here to over here from to over here please more amplitude I guess thing I think okay from here also I don't know what it's gonna looks like but anyway let's try it from here export to Kikotia save yes yes open in Kikotia then apply material sorry apply metal material And render so now the rendering completed let's check the final image not bad but in a kind of way it is really bad because we don't get that material feeling right here but anyway guys that's it hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial hope it helps and thanks for watching my videos if you like this video then please give a big thumbs up comment share that may help me a lot guys and I will see you guys again tomorrow goodbye You can of course you can differentiate the selection and the unselected deselected parts so just hit on delete and you will create a spiral